Yeah, you got something to say for yourself right now? It's recording. You got something to say for yourself? No, no, I'm good. You good? Yes. All right, good. So let me tell you a story about something that happened this morning. Hare Krishna to all of devotees and friends, family. It's me, Bhakta Caprice, AKA Sunman Patu. So I'm out here in Cambria Heights or whatever neighborhood this is, it's the beautiful borough of Queens, right? And in Queens, it's so big, sometimes you gotta take more than one bus to get to your destination. But me, where I live in the boondocks, I have to take a bus to the train, and then from the train, I take other buses to come to different parts of Queens or Far Rockaway. So what happened very recently was, I got on the bus, right, and I knew I was going to a three-fare zone, so I paid my fare. And a fare, you automatically get a transfer to another bus or train. So I got my transfer on my card, and I said, you know what, I need, I need another transfer because I'm going to a three-fare bus zone. Hello, Mr. Bus Driver. You know, can I get a um, transfer? And he puts his hands up in the air. I can't help you with that, right? And I said, fine. You know, I put on my sad face. Okay, thank you, sir. And I walked away and sat down humbly, right? So I said to myself, yo, man, I'm on my way to go see a friend who happens to be a little sick right now, either materially, spiritually, physically, whatever. My friend is going through some problems, feeling sad, feeling low. So I said, all right, boom, I'm going to bring her some prashad, and I'm going to teach her the Hare Krishna mantra. So because I'm working for Krishna, this man don't have to do me no favors. All he got to do is let me on the bus. That's devotional service for him, whether he knows it or not. He gets credit for that, spiritual credit. So something tells me, go back and ask this man what country he's from. So I get up. I walk up to the bus, front of the bus. I say, excuse me, sir, you from Guyana? As soon as I said, are you from Guyana? The man just popped the Metro card right out the machine. I tell you no lie, so transcendental service is unlimited. Anything can happen. When you're working for Krishna, you get all kind of prop um, perks. You get, a, I mean, I, I remember one time I was on the Long Island Railroad and the train operator saw me reading a book called Sri Ishopanishad, which is a very, very exalted, advanced book. Get it if you can. Sri Ishopanishad, spelled Isopanishad, right? And I'm reading it, minding my business. He didn't know nothing about Hare Krishna, but for some reason he came, he walked up to me, he saw me reading this book, and he said, your ticket is good. So remember, Krishna is the ticket. No matter what you're going through in life, you know what I'm saying, I've seen a lot of things. I've seen a lot of good times and bad times, but my darkest times in life, I was living in Cambria Heights, no, St. Albans by Farmers and 109 by The Rock. Those were the darkest nights of my life. That was right after 2008 when there was a fire in my crib. A lot of things had happened and I was going through some dark times. But right after that, right after the darkest hour, was when I came into Krishna consciousness. And my life has never been the same. Thank you. Hare Krishna.